before we start this reaction, I just want to tell you about the brand called Journey Instruments. That's a brand that makes travel gear, specifically uh, travel guitars. And they are not just smaller, they are actually compact and foldable guitars. They not only have foldable classical and acoustic guitars, they also have foldable acoustic basses. I think they might have foldable ukuleles, I'm not sure of that. But they also have foldable carbon fiber guitars, and now they also have foldable electric guitars, of which I have one. Not only are they super compact, they literally fit into a backpack that is included with the guitar. They also look great and they sound super good. So if you are a guitar player, bass player, ukulele player, whatever, and you like to travel a lot or you just like to bring along your instrument without everyone noticing it or without struggling, without worrying that the arm might break, this is a perfect solution for you guys. And all for the price of $500, which is, in my opinion, a very good deal. So if you want to buy some of their products, please use the affiliate link in the description down below. It doesn't cost you anything more, and it just helps me a little bit. So thank you very much, and let's continue with the reaction. Let's see, I'm going to I'm going to take a sip right here. Okay. Oh, Tika. <laughs> you have another one from NF. Man. Oh. Tika. Another one from an from an F, so uh, let's go with that. Uh, in the meantime, I hope, um, I hope delusional can answer which one he wants because his suggestion was next. Let's see, an F story. Uh. And have real music. So this is it's this one. Let's see. Pretty curious. We first have the advertisement, like usual. Okay. Tika. NF started out as a Christian rapper, but inner fan fri inner fan fighting caused him to tell everyone stop and enjoy do you mean there was fighting in between the fans cause them to tell everyone to stop and enjoy okay and what was it about the fighting was it about religious things that they argued or oh delusional oh well yes it will be uh i'll see i haven't reacted to tina s so probably that's a good choice oh i <laughs> okay okay well we'll we'll just continue we'll just see what what we get right Here we go, NF story. Better to turn on the music, right? <laughs> Here we go. Very relatable. Checking the phone late night in your bed. Or Woke early up in, in a bad place Should probably get up so I'm not late Stared at my phone for the past eight Minutes at nothing, my head aches Bottles empty by the lampshade Mod of Excedrin again, great Too early to tell, but at this rate I'm thinking this might be a bad day I walk out the bedroom, my roommates I sleep on the couch with their two-faced Boyfriend who lives here but don't pay A penny for rent, but he still stays She says he's broke, I'm like, no way Probably sells drugs, but she won't say Told me he dabbles in real estate I mean, I don't believe it, but okay Okay, pull out the driveway Notice my gas tank's on E again Well, of course it is Guess I probably should stop at the gas station So I take a 
right Pull up to the pump While it's pumping I look at my ashtray Then remember I need to get cigarettes, cigarettes. Anything that help my mind state So I park and walk Everything that is just going wrong And it's so relatable All the things that he's talking about right Man Hi there Stine Welcome Welcome back <laughs> All the frustrations and it's so relatable, like I said. You wake up in the morning, you don't feel like waking up. The first thing you do, check out, check your phone. Uh, and certainly if you have a roommate, you get out and you see, like, I mean, <laughs> everything that is happening. You get in your car, you want to go to work. Your car, uh, the tank is empty. You feel like, oh, I don't really have time to refill the fuel right now. It's really relatable. Just stop at the gas station so I take a right. Pull up to the pump while it's pumping. I look at my ass. I mean, I don't, don't remember. Smoke. I need to get cigarettes. cigarettes. Anything but. to help my mind state. So I park and walk inside. Wait, I should probably get something to drink and eat, I guess. So I find and grab a couple bags of chips. Where's the candy aisle? Oh, yeah, here it is. Which one should I get? Should I <laughs> grab the Starburst or change it up and maybe grab the Twix? Mm, grab the Starburst and I started walking as I passed the garbage and I reached a fridge. I hear someone yelling at the front of the store. Probably just a homeless guy. Getting bored, probably just a customer whose car didn't work, and now he wants to start a war. Man, I can't afford to keep buying energy drinks every day. I shut the door, then turn around, and as I'm heading towards the counter with my drink, I hear, Hey, open up the drawer! Crouching on the floor, peek around the aisle, gun is on the floor. Well, I was just about to say, so far, it sounded like a pretty relatable day. Like everyone has sometimes with the frustrations that we all have. That just escalated pretty quickly. You have to see no messages <laughs> in Phoenix, exactly. I mean, there's always something that you can do, but it's it's true, like, you don't always need to. But we do. We do. Head of the man that's behind the counter Now my heart is pounding and I'm praying to the Lord I don't die today, I can't die today I got things to do, trying not to shake Plotting my escape, where's my cell phone at? Left it in my car, icing on the cake Oh, oh man, like that is really the icing on the cake The one time that you do need your phone, you don't have it You always have it, but the moment that you actually need it, you don't have it That's some kind of story Plot in my escape. Where's my cell phone at? Left it in my car. Icing on the cake. I start calling. I can hear him yelling. I want every penny. I want every dime. Yeah. Once you finish with the cash, open up the bag. Throw some cigarettes inside. Yeah. Which ones do you want? Which ones do you want? I'm not picky. Give me any kind. Give me all of them. Yeah, just toss them in. Keep it moving. No, I'm running low on time. And I'd advise you to move a little quicker. Trust me, I don't want to have to pull the trigger. I've done it before. It's not a pretty picture. What, you don't believe me? I'm just playing with you. Well, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Just what I say cause if you even think of trying to pull a fast one on me Promise you'll be sorry Oh my driver's calling I can't miss my pickup That's when I did something stupid And my jacket knocked over a can of soup And then it got quiet Did he hear me moving? Shh, hold my breath He must have heard me do it Huh, I'm assuming the noise must have made him turn his head Enough to let the guy that was at gunpoint grab his own gun Now they both got weapons Maybe I should help him sneak up slow and deck him Time to go, time to go, time to go It's gonna be a bloody miracle Now I never got it fired Any blessings coming in my future Could you send them to my present? Peek around the edge and I start running at him He don't see me coming, does he step in closer? Grab his neck and hold him, squeezing on his throat I'm trying to choke him, then his elbow hits my nose and Think he broke it, I think he broke it My blood is leaking all over my clothes I try not to let go, but my hands begin to slip And bullets start to fly Oh my Can't god see my eyes. Cash is still alive I can tell him, trying to crawl away Here comes another guy He runs inside like, where's the money? Did you get the money? Where's the bag you brought? I Oh my god. Who? A final last shot. I, oh my god.
Well, she felt like it was going to be a bad Cash day. Yells to ask if I'm okay. He's dialing 911. I run over to him, grab his phone, and try to help him up. It's been a robbery. The cashier was shot. He needs an ambulance. He looks kind of pale. I think he might have lost a lot of blood. Yeah, the robbers, there were two of them. Well, I'm not really sure, but they don't look so good. I'm pretty sure they're dead. Yeah, I think they're dead. Talk about a bad day. I mean, compared to the other three, she got out. Man, uh, I don't wish this story to anybody. That was intense, man. I just see that a colleague of mine has entered the chat. Leander, all is cool. I heard you like acapella music. Check out <laughs> Van Canto then. <laughs> all right. If you want to hear uh, the acapella really shine, go for Go for Fear of the Dark. Or try an original song like I Die in Battle. <laughs> um, Let's see here. Uh, Tika, that second guy was the no good boy. Oh, really? The no good boyfriend of roommate. How do you know? You don't see his face, right? Or is... Or did you know his clothing was the was the same? 